Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. It's time to finally check out the wedding event, which runs from June 1st to June 30th. I've been really excited for this one because I think it's going to be one of the best events so far in Animal Crossing New Horizons. I know the bar isn't very high right now, but the items I actually really like. And today we're going to be checking out the event. And then we're going to be figuring out how to maximize the amount of items that you can get each day. So this does involve Harv's Island. So we're going to be needing to go to the Dodo Airlines and uh, traveling to Harv's Island and see what we got going on for this event. You know, this is actually my first time going to Harv's Island. Almond Jelly Static. Looks like we got a whole lot of radio chatter going on over yonder. Oh, uh, yeah. They're discussing their sweet, sweet wedding. All right, Harv, what do we got going on here? I hear you, we're still groovy, and the anniversary shoot's gonna happen, and I'm just, like, behind a little. Hmm, well, all right, but uh, what do we do about the lovely sets? Prepping them ourselves could get a bit ticklish. Of course, that's when I roll in. That would be when I roll in. Hey there, you got some good timing, you know that? Can I, like, borrow you for a minute? So, this here is Reese. Her name, Squeeze Cyrus. <laughs> They're married and in love. A whole bunch. Far out, right? Anyway, they want to get some anniversary photos made. Fancy ones with scents and stuff. And because it's June now, and June is wedding season, uh, here they are. June is a whole season now. <laughs> Thing is, I'm cool with lending out my studio, but my wedding sets are running slightly behind schedule. I'd order decorations and painted the walls and floor, but then a neat bird flew by, and there went May. Long story, someone's still got to move the stuff around so it looks wedding-y, then snap some photos. So I think I could ask you to be that someone? You'd really be helping this stutter dog out. Shutter dog out. All right, I guess we can do that, right? Oh, you're a solid one. Uh, come on, let's go. This is my wedding picture studio. It's, uh, actually, my kitchen with some wet walls I put up. Wow, with some set walls. Let me know if you get hungry. Uh, since it's your first time in one of my studios, let me give you the rundown real quick. You can press down to change the decor in the studio, just like you do at home. Oh, and speaking of set decorations, I've got a special deal going on with Nook Shopping. So if it's in your catalog, you can just borrow one and spot are in the spot to use it in your set. Sweet, like granola, right? Oh, and one thing. If you gotta take five part way through, no prob. Talk to me before you go back in, all right? Otherwise, Reese is in charge. So if you want to know what to do, she's your alpaca. Cool? All right, all right, all right. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, right? Hello there. It's so nice to meet you. I'm Reese, and I'm just pleased as punch that you're helping us out. And this is my hubby, my darling. My name's Cyrus. Good to meet you. Kind of looks like Elvis, doesn't he? Uh, I just know these photos are going to be so romantic, and I'm just in time for our anniversary. Of course, we do this every year for our anniversary, but it's always special, isn't it? It's just like a slice of life from that year. A delicious slice, almost sweet as our love, right, hun? Oh, boy. That's right, sweater. Wait, sweeter. <laughs> sweeter than the sweetest shaved ice. Oh, you such a romantic. Oh. I forgot we were doing what we were doing for a second there. We just get so lost in our own little world sometimes. Anywho, so here's what we're thinking for this year's photo set. A recreation of our entire wedding day. And you can help us by making this place feel like we're saying I do all over again. It'll be just like decorating your own place. Easy peasy. Oh, I almost forgot. My amazing Psy guy even built some custom wedding furniture for the shoot. Isn't that so sweet of my schmoopy? Oh my god, you really put his heart into him, so I hope you can get them to work. Just open up the event tab and take a look and grab what you want for the shoot, all right? So today I'm thinking we should take a ceremony photo in a place that looks like a wedding chapel. It'll be just like our real ceremony, professing our love for each other in front of everyone. So romantic. What we're looking for is a cute set with plenty of pink and white, preferably using lots of furniture from Psy Guy made. Okay. Just let us know when you're ready uh, for us to start posing. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Well, easy peasy lemon squeezy. So let's go ahead and get into this. Over here and then event tab. Ah, 
So we only have a few items right now. And I'm assuming probably as we go through this, we're probably going to unlock more items. Um, but let's go ahead and do this. I do know already that the more items you put in, the more hearts you get as you go through. But thank you to the community for letting me know. I literally woke up to a couple messages already on how to maximize this. So thankfully I'm going into this knowing already how to maximize the amount of hearts we can get right at the beginning of this. Uh, we got to see if we can actually, you know, back, go back and forth through time uh, to repeat these days in case you don't maximize your hearts. Because uh, you're going to be... The hearts are basically a currency to pick up all of these items and purchase them for yourself. And if you're somebody who really wants to either stock up on these for trades later in the year, or I kind of actually like having them higher up, I think. Or just getting a lot of items to be able to decorate your island and do weddings and stuff. Then you're going to need to know how to maximize the amount of hearts you can get every single day that you do this. So we've used pretty much every item that we have available. And you need to have at least 12 uh, items placed to get the maximum 15 hearts every time. Now I don't know if we can get 15 hearts on the first few days of doing this. We're going to try and figure it out right now. We've definitely got 12 pieces. I think we got uh, 3, 6, uh, so 12, and then 15, 18, or 15, 16, 17 pieces out right now. So let's see how many hearts we get for this. And uh, hopefully it makes them happy little uh, cubs coming along. Does, does, I just said cubs. They're alpacas. Does this mean you're ready for us to start the photo session? Oh, let's tie the knot. Do this. But before we get started, I do have another teensy request. Will you be our photographer? Don't get me wrong, Harvey is great. It's just, this lovely set is your vision, and I want you to realize it. So when you're ready, press the ZL to launch the camera up, and press plus to take the picture. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh, and I know you're asking a lot, but I also know you've got this. I can't wait to see what you come up with. All right. So, there we go. It's interesting. Is he just going to, like, just creepily stare at her? Kind of want to, like, let's go with... I don't think doing any of this matters, but I'm going to do it just because. Do we have any, like, new borders or anything? So there's no new borders, and there's no new, like, um, thingamabobbers. There we go. We'll uh, just do, do that right there. He looks so grumpy. It's your wedding day. Be happy. Can we not do any reactions or anything either? Oh, wait, there we go. So maybe if we do this right next to him, I just want to see if we get more points for, like, uh, making them re Will they not react at all? They are stone-faced, ladies and gentlemen. Good lord. All right, well, let's go ahead and turn that in and see what we got, hey? That last one seemed nice. Mind if I take a quick peek? Did you take more than one? I just look at the last one if that's okay. Well, that's good to know. What you think there, Reese? Let's see... Oh my goodness, it's everything I could have wanted. You've somehow captured all the joy and love that my darling and I share in one amazing photo. I love it. Anyway, I have a little something to show our appreciation. I hope you like it. My side guy made it just for you. It's a wedding bench. Oh, well, thank you kindly, Reese. And sigh. <laughs> and because I'm just full of surprises, I've also got some heart crystals for you. They're so cute that I just hate to give them away. But my side guy likes them too. He'll trade you for furniture. Aha! Well, that's good to know. Well, obviously, we knew that already. But uh, it's good to know that's from Sai. Once again, thank you for such uh, for everything. You helped us make a wonderful new memory. All right, so we can come back tomorrow. We have the studio space rented for the entire month. Oh, my God. She just wants photos the entire month. All right. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. So how many hearts crystals? So we got 11. There we go. Um, now somebody did mention that you might only be able to get 11, uh, during the early days of the event. Um, so we'll see if we can get more throughout the rest of the first week. Um, but let's see how much. Howdy, Squirt. Any interest in training those heart crystals for some furniture? Reese thinks they're pretty. All right, what do we got going on here? So we got wedding bench, wedding decoration, the white wall, white wedding flooring, and blue wedding rug. So... These are all the items we can get right now, which isn't too bad. So you can get two benches on the first day if you wanted to. Um, 
But as we go through each day, we're going to unlock more items and we're going to be able to unlock up to a maximum of like 15 heart crystals each day. So I wanted to do some testing just to verify the maximum hearts that we can get on the first few days of the event. And to give you all some additional information on how to maximize your hearts each day so you can get the most amount of items the fastest. Uh, so when you come back to Harvey's Island, you have to talk to him and you have to select anniversary photos to get back into the event. Let's talk to Reese and see what she's got going on today. Oh, thanks so much for coming back to work with us another set of photos. I can't wait to see how these ones turn out. We've already done the ceremony photos. I think it would be fun to recreate the reception this time. We had such a big fancy party, didn't we? Such good food and all of our family and friends. Oh, and by the way, my handy dandy side guy made some new furniture. Isn't he the best? Anyway, now you have to uh, have even more to work with. Just take a look at the event tab again. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Looking for the cute set with plenty of pink and white. Preferably using lots of... Okay, yep. Whenever you're done with photos, come back to me. Thanks, thanks, thanks. So, uh, a couple extra bits of information. Right now, we only have access to the things that they make each day. But eventually, we're going to have all three colorways of the wedding furniture. So, we're not going to have the cute set. We're going to have the cute, chic, and the garden set. And Reese is going to ask for different sets when you talk to her. You're going to need to keep this in mind. Uh, wait, so uh, so we got the white wedding wall and the white wedding party wall. So we're going to use the parting wa party wall this time. Uh, maybe we'll use some rugs. We'll definitely still use some wedding decorations because you do need to use 12 items to maximize your things each day. So that's 12 items even through like the first couple days when you're still unlocking all of the stuff. Uh, and you can use 12 of the same item. If you just want to plow through this and you don't care about making it pretty, you could literally just put out 12 wedding decorations like this. And that will maximize your heart. So you don't even have to make it pretty, which is kind of lame, honestly. Um, you don't even have to put any amount of work into it. You can put out 12 of any item. You can put out 12 chairs and you'd still get the maximum. Um, and that goes for not only the first few days, but all these subsequent days as well. But the caveat to that is they all need to match. So if she asks for the chic set, then you have to go in and manually change. So you have to click on each one and select the colorway of that and change them all to chic to get the maximum amount of hearts. So just keep that in mind. 12 items and they all need to be the same um, colorway. Other than that, relatively easy. There's nothing really mu much else to it. So let's go ahead and uh, set this up and I'm going to make it look pretty just because why not. Now, I know there's going to be a lot of people asking if there's any other variables, like adding other villagers or anything like that. But as far as we can tell from testing throughout the community, that all it does is rely on using the items that Reese asks for and making sure you have 12 items placed. Um, so your first maximum is going to be 11. And once you get out of kind of like the like tutorial story part of it, um, then you can get a maximum of 15. So let's see how she likes this. I don't know if she gets any different dialogue. That last one seemed nice. Mind if I take a quick peek? Did you make more than one? No, we did not. Okay, let's go ahead and get through this. And let's see. Okay, same exact dialogue. Somehow captured all the joy and love. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And she made us a wedding table. Or a side guy made us a wedding table, rather. So that's nice. We get some free items during this process. And we get some heart crystals as well. So just like before, we got 11 more. I believe it's the first seven days that you're going to be only able to get 11 hearts as your maximum. And then after that, once you unlock all of the items and colorways, um, then you're going to be able to unlock a maximum of 15 hearts per day. Um, but yeah, it's really, really simple. There isn't anything to it. They, they don't even have to be in the photo to get your maximum hearts. So if you don't really care about making it pretty, all you need to do is just slap out 12 different things take a photo, make sure all of the things are actually the same colorway though, and make sure that the thing that the, she asks for, eventually she's going to start asking for, uh, so this is the cute set, she's going to ask for like the chic set and the garden set, and that's going to take a little bit more time because you need to change the colorway to get the maximum hearts, but everything needs to be matching and you just need 12. Other than that, super duper easy. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Now, if you're curious about all the different colorways, I do have a video on that and I'll leave a link in the description so you can check that out. But I do hope everybody enjoyed this. Let me know what you think about the event in the comments below. And I do like that there is a progression to it. It's kind of got a story and it, and it progresses and I'm actually a fan of this event and I do like the items 
But anyways, I hope you all like it as well. I'll see you in the next one.